us a bit of an insight into the heat exchange system that you're installing here at the hospital and into the, the chiller system that you're also commissioning. Explain to us the technical aspects thereof. Okay. Um, well, essentially, uh, we, we looked at a, a system for MediClinic that would, would save them uh, a lot of money in operating costs. Okay, the current plant had got to the end of its uh, lifespan, uh, 25, 30 years old now, so they were looking to upgrade that. But, you know, obviously energy efficiency is, is one of the driving factors. So, essentially what we were looking at is shifting their load during the daytime so that they could save money in their running costs. We also looked at um, recovering heat from the chiller plant to provide them with hot water for free uh, instead of their standard electrical uh, elements that would uh, heat up the, the plant. So what we looked at was two, two systems, okay, which would combine to serve the entire plant uh, for cooling and heating requirements of the hospital. So we looked at a heat recovery on the base load chiller because the hospital has a 24 hour cooling load. So we knew we could recover heat 24 hours a day, 365 days of the year. So the base load chiller handles half of the cooling capacity of the, of the hospital during the peak of summer. At the moment on a cold day like today, it's reduced down to about 12% of the, of the chiller capacity itself. But we are still recovering heat and it's enough to provide hot water and it heats up about 54,000 litres of, of stored hot water. And explain to you in terms of the energy savings that you have as a result of the system. Well essentially we're giving them this hot water for free. So we're heating up that 54,000 litres for free. Uh, it's recovered heat whilst providing cooling to the hospital. So there is no cost to heat that, where previously you would pay to heat those 54,000 litres. And we are getting up to 55 degrees temperature hot water out of that in those tanks. Um, then for the rest of the cooling load, we looked at saving energy by shifting, um, shifting the load to night time. And to do that, we've introduced an ice storage system. Um, now essentially what that does is we make the ice during nighttime hours when the demand charges are low and the energy costs are low. In a time of use tariff, it's the cheapest time to, to make, uh, use your electricity. So what we're doing is we're running the ice chiller at night, making ice in these tanks, and then we are um, using this ice during the day.